There's only two more Time to on. do, and that is a Mr. Ian Goff and Matthew Reese, former Wales internationals, who are keeping me warm in the commentary box. Good evening, man. Keatley pulls it back. There's a little bit of space here. Into the hands of Esposito. Over the top, back inside then to Rutsa. Back into the hands of Sperandio. And it will be the fullback who will open the scoring for the visitors. Exactly what Benetton Rugby wanted. They came out of the box. Rutsa takes it at the front. They set. Thomas Baravale, the hooker, is in there. Keatley adds his weight, as does Chisardi, still edging towards that Dragons line. It drops down, they're still going over the line, and you have to say, they took the chance, went for the corner, and it is another try for the visitors. Williams. Oh, Scrooge, lovely offload, and that's great pace coming from Reynolds. Well, the front row is superb, and a lovely offload is a what a try, scrum half. And Captain Rodri Williams, well, you have to credit Street in the first instance. Electric plate from front rower Josh Reynolds. The impressive Charlie Trussardi leaves the field. A play replaced by Luca Petrozzi. That's scrum half for the visitors. Got oh, a lovely little offload on that blind side. Really against the runner play. Into the hands of Esposito. And he evades couple of weaker tackles from the Dragon and it is Benetton who start the second half exactly the way they started the game. Williams does well, slides, takes it exceptionally well, finds his pullback. Tolva Davis look to find grass. And it is Esposito Sperandillo. Excellent chase coming from Aston Hewitt. Well, they say about chasing a lost cause and that was great work from Aston Hewitt. Alapihi was playing the half-back role, he takes it on, he's in there somewhere. Still they go on their feet looking towards that try, they're looking to get that bonus point to possibly secure the win. Clancy is there on his knees, he sees the ball go down. The Italians from Benetton are cheering. He comes in, as does replacing Scrum Arbluck Baldwin. Calling for more numbers, you can hear him from here. They're going to get towards that line. A little bit of momentum now from the Dragons. Benetton doing everything they can to stop it. They're over the line. It's scant consolation, but it is another try for the home side. It's another good strike. Just drifts past the upright. George Clancy puts the whistle to his mouth and blows for the end of the game. It is the Dragons 25, Benetton Rugby 37, and it is the Italians that take the spoils.